Hello, hello, my lovelies. Sigita here. Um, little update on what's going on and uh, little uh, pocket as well. We are going to do some some things. So what's actually going on is I have been very busy these past, I think, few two, three days. Um, quickly, I just forgot to take. Sorry, guys. <laughs> so, sorry, guys, I forgot. Look, I have been busy. <clears throat> this is not all. So what I wanted just to quickly show you. Uh, I made these kind of charms on a wire, right? These are uh, made using resin. Okay. I absolutely love, love, love them. Uh, on a journal. Uh, these, uh, I actually, um, I am as well going to do... Uh, I am like looking for the right word. I am preparing myself or I am going back to or I'm starting <laughs> again <clears throat> with a new ideas. But I will be a little bit slightly moving into necklaces, into jewelry. I can never, I can never ever say that word. But anyway, moving into necklaces a little bit. Remember, if some uh, one have been following uh, following to my old channel, I have been making like bracelets and necklaces time to time, just a few. But now I like want a little bit kind of more. I'm not leaving journaling. That's you know, there's no way. But uh, and I want to do a mixed media necklaces you know with like old stuff and things like this so these are like charms uh, for necklaces i was making but at the same time uh i am going to use them in a journals as well so how would i use it i am making a very small journal just a scrap one one signature really nice one small one uh, I will embellish a little bit and then it's going to be available uh, and like I'm adding little kind of letter here and something else gonna be there so and let's see like what I'm going I think I will go to do I will do that like to put this one you know I like to cover and put on a brats a lot of things so if I put this one on I maybe I have to shorten a little bit but like uh, I will put this on, on a brad, right, on a cover, on a brad, and then I can move it. How cool is this? And in, in a journal, we can use exactly for the same right effect. We put on a journal, it's nice and flat, it's not like a really extra bulk, and we can move it. Gorgeous, gorgeous uh, embellishment for journals. If we have larger journal, we can shorten this wire to very like short, and we can use as uh, a charms hanging down from a journal side. So this is what I want to do. I want to uh, incorporate for journals and kind of for necklaces as well. This is my first try. And I really love how they turned out. I wasn't sure they will turn out. Actually, I was surprised they are turning out so great. Um, this is print, print, just a print on a normal inject printer. Uh, this is stamped. So th this is flexible one. Remember when I was making a little review on resin? I said that I will try to make a resin of these um, proportions we have to put together. Hardener, I will put a little bit less to get that paper more flexible. 
and yes it did work it is flexible here and flexible here but then when i do exactly uh, a proportions i have to do is written like on a jar you get to look nice hard pieces look at this look just at that this is fresh i just you know went out and picked from i just want to show you closer can you is it okay is some white uh let's zoom a bit look at that this is black current little leaves and buds Whoa! look is it, nothing happened right uh this is a back side Probably I should cover this as well. As I said, this is the first, first time I'm working with resin, but I really, really love it. This as well as a charm, no, this is not, this is too big. But for necklace, yes. And there is a, there's a lot of such, so many new things, guys. <laughs> My head is going around. I am moving as well into new craft, I would say. Which as well I will be using for jewelry, for, uh, let's say for necklaces and as well for journals. So that's, uh, yeah, I just have to look for supplies, where to purchase, how to do, what to, I will tell you, I will show you. So this as well is chocolate a uh, silicone molds. Look, here I put in little bits, these little bits from um, lavender. And look how gorgeous it's like little flower and here look i put in rose petals how gorgeous is this so these as well i have to drill little hole i how small like especially for this little drill you put on a you know little chain or something and attach it as well you know, you can do it because this is not uh, really thick. I didn't pour that mold full. I poured a little bit to make them thinner. Uh, this you can like, like turn into uh, earrings as well. Use in my like necklaces. This or in a necklace like these together would be nice. So yeah, things like that. And there is one more craft. As I said, I am like going towards. Uh, <laughs> I am not telling you yet. But I have been wanting to do that for ages. Like really for years. Um, but I just have to find right. Uh, you know, as always, I choose a um, craft. is not really in my country. <laughs> so but no i will get there i will get there so and uh one more new thing is then i purchased little class which is as well for necklaces exactly for necklaces i cannot show you because they are drying like bases are drying uh for resin as well is like two days at least two day drying time for this class for necklaces there will be like wax involved and and paints and all stuff i will show you when it's going to be ready i will give you link to that class afterwards as well there will be special of course video that would be more like it's the update of course there's there, there is no there will not be video how to make them is not my class but definitely i will put links down i will uh describe it i will show you i love it i really love that but that's coming that's just little you know little sneak talk <laughs> right so now what's happening now is I am back to envelope cover journal at last, right, I'm covering, I'm making some flips with envelope, that's on my Patreon. I am doing this little small journal, just, you know, little bits and pieces, so a scrap one. Uh, this is going to be together, and one more thing is going to be, this is going to be available, I'm, this is just, I'm like playing around, you know and bits like that and then today i want to i have nails painted guys uh yeah 
I did it myself actually and not bad I, I love the color I love the color yeah so I did that too I don't know is it and it's horrible time outside it's like snowish rain I probably that's because I painted my nails so I uh, scared the spring away okay so what I wanted to tell you next next you're going to make double pocket idea absolutely is not mine right i love the i will do little bit differently kind of but then original video but in a general is the same this is a double pocket bag an idea is from i have to look on a of course on our computer is from jennifer and she is uh, you know that youtube changed this way they do that writing show more and everything all that you know is in one line now i cannot get it what's where so i have to every time really look so why they did that why they cannot create better everything they do is like worse all right i cannot find her sh youtuber um she is for god's sake where is it seriously okay a trace of sparkle she's trace of sparkle as uh, her idea, I, I look, I, I, I'm following her video. Uh, she is one I haven't um, been subscribed, I haven't watched it, but I like what she is making. Right, another one I really like what she is doing is. Um, <laughs> is I have to look so another video i am really was inspired so come on move is ruby and pearl right love 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 her videos as well one i haven't been watched before right i love the way she works and her name is heather right heather from ruby and pearl and from her i took idea with this white rose embossing paper she really nicely did like um, tag and she had like um, this white embossed paper on the top i loved how that look you know i don't like white right but like in this little journal i was using especially white laces white they are not like uh, right they are not uh, inked or or they are not um, coffee stained and look i put as well up there and I was making little tag. Where is it? Little tag with dried flower in, and I just um, attached the staple, the little piece, so that white paper. I love it. Actually, really like it. So yeah, and I remembered. I completely forgot I have embossing folders. So yeah, I just pulled out an embossing folder. It's a small one from AliExpress, like this so to emboss whole page i have to put it down down four times but it does worth it i really like it. it's nice embossing this is on cardstock really really nice so these two girls lately i have been watching quite a uh, quite a few videos and this like i uh kind of took fr from them all right let's get to that double pocket so what's going on there? Uh, we are using paper bag, right? We are using paper bag like this. 
um, she had I think a little bit uh, longer back I have a little bit different but doesn't matter that's I'm not like you know really need her bag this is I think more like this is thin this is thin bag I think could be for um, burgers they are not from my country we don't use that kind of bags I think that's still from UK so anyway so what's happened is size any bag of course is fine but is like six and what three fourth right and seven just roughly but anyway what you do you just fold in a half you fold on a half and you will have pocket here and pocket here right but I do, um, I'm not really happy about this height. I want it a little bit lower down. So what I'm going to do, simply cut it down. Simply, maybe even more, I will cut it down. And that front, I want it on triangle. So again, okay, I can maybe not as much, just a little bit. So where is that fold here? So from fold, I just cut it that way off. So we have something like that fold it on a half right i like this so it's easier to see what's where and it's not as high so now it is height height five and a half completely fine so then i want to cover it because this is too thin and i don't like it and I print it out on a cardstock, right, to give like proper sturdy a feel. So these papers are from Itsy, from Eva, from Bohemian Crafting. So I will put the link down below just in case you are interested. I hope I will remember to put all links down. But before i start to cover i want as well as usually what i want to do i want to make sure that fold is quite secure because we are going to open it many times We are going to be opening and closing many times and I don't want it to break, you know, so quickly. So always when I do some folds like that, for like folios, I always secure it with masking tape, right? From outside. Okay. Look, now we have nice, sturdy fold. Okay. Why not from inside? Sometimes I do both, outside and inside. Why not from inside? Uh, now, uh, simply because uh, it makes creases when I like fold it gets creased more than outside that's why why i just stopped i thought because i want to do like pockets and still a little bit of small journals kind of inside not journal i would say booklet would be like double pocket booklet so that's what i'm for thinking maybe to put like just for fun in 
you do? Not here, not here. Let's cover and then put on the top. Yeah, so what's the point then? So now what I want, I see, I, I, I like kind of cut them already, right? Because otherwise you will have to. So I want this to be seen more. I don't want you to watch my cutting because I was already on a Piatron and I was more talking and cutting than actually showing what I'm doing. So sorry, I quickly cut it. Cut things. Right, like that. A little bit, like tiny bit smaller than actual pocket okay and i need another one exactly the same like this. Right, so this is for front I like the blue and for a back right straight cut me somewhere oh uh, I'm not as sure no I don't like measuring but this is kind of measuring Maybe a little bit off. off this side. Tiny, tiny bit like that. Yeah, like this. We need two of them. Oh, that two. And tiny bit here. Right. Okay. So we have four to push everything away. Right. And what I will do, I will glue on. Or do I have to cut it now? I think I have to cut it now, actually. Yeah, but I will cut that nice writing off. You know what I want to do? that nice writing off okay yes yeah, that's fine so another one and it opposite this way
Now you can keep the right height. Just for the wall. What is that? Strange. Very strange. Anyway, I cut this something probably wrong, but as always, <laughs> that is no, no surprise. <clears throat> right, okay. I need that. This way. As you can see, even with measurements, I cannot cut it right. So nice and secure. Just slightly. Mm -hmm. And we can glue it on. Glow stick as always. My tool. Mm -hmm. So bone folder works nicely this way as well. Look nice, nice and sturdy. Okay. And nice and sturdy is this one. Really? Right. I always miss the corners, I don't know why. Okay. Like that. Straight away is nice and sturdy. Look how nice this is. Have to make more. And about making, I'm making these two journals. One, of course, is going to be longer one. Another one is going to be quicker one. That's small one, probably. Of course, not probably. Uh, but I am as well going to prepare. Uh, I'm preparing slowly. Um, I think I need um, two sets. One is going to be that black paper pack, that folded one, which is like really extra black with different papers inside. I'm going to prepare that. And another set will be with like book pages and rusted fabric and yeah stuff like that but as well you know things i want to make i need some time for it and some um, as well drawings involved so yeah it will be it will be available so. Like a lot, a lot of new ideas and new things. All 
All right, just, I'm not sure. Can you see me? Yeah. Don't, is it okay? Was I always out of, always? Was I, was I all the time? Oops, too close. Out of the focus. Seriously, guys, I'm sorry. Probably I didn't zo Oh my god. Okay. Good I like, uh, you know. Because I probably didn't put focus back when I was showing you this little... Little... Because there is nothing really, you know. Just to glow down paper. I love this. Yeah, nice and sturdy. Nice and sturdy. And this one is exactly how I need it. So, is covered, look, from outside to inside. Nice. So, and pocket is here and pocket is there. But what I want to do, I want to... Uh, punch it, punch that little, to get easy in and out, like that, look, mm -hmm. I like it, and now we have, Pocket here, right? And we have pocket there. Okay, and pocket here. And it's nice and a stable as well. So next, what I want to do next is. Oh, talking about next, I wanted to, this is like rusted, mm, do I need to put this in, have a little bit of bulk, or just to put in papers and that's it. Maybe we need a little bit more fun. <laughs> and by fun, I mean maybe some more different papers. Papers, fabrics. Maybe this one. This is nice. I love this one. Of course, it's pink. No, this is too plain. Too plain. Oh, this is not bad. I love these bits. And again, I... Okay, this is as well not bad. And these as well are from AliExpress. Can you imagine this little piece? I like this. No, I think I like this one. Or this one. And it's fine. Okay, let's do this one. These pieces are from AliExpress. Um, 
it's just cheaper <laughs> simply and i don't think i can get such a little pieces because i just need for journaling i'm not going to sew anything and uh, yeah this is cotton cotton okay and we just glue it down i think that will be more fun you can put lace in as well actually would be nice You know, but for more romantic. But I like it, but it's not really my kind of thing. Just slightly. Okay, it's one side more. Okay. I'm not cutting right off there. I want to leave a little bit. Why was that? It's mine. Right now, let's go in. So, um, Jennifer, she didn't put in any paper. She just left like that. I am not going to put a lot of papers in either. It's not a journal, right? It's just a tiny booklet. So, I'm just grab some. Papers. Kind of like this. Let's see. It's sticking out there, but that's fine because it's going to be a um, tag in there. So tag is going to be there, and uh, when you open, you have papers. And tag up there. I think that's fine, completely. That's a more. I think that's more interest. Uh, adds more interest. I am not stitching a these sewing machine. I will just grab and stitch it in by hand. Uh, is it okay now? Can you see? Just two, two pokes, poke here 
and I'm just making from inside And now we can, and this is kind of, that's it, right? This is all kind of, I wanted to show you how nice we can turn little bag, right, into, I have these bags for ages, I haven't used them. Because I thought they are too thin, of course they have to, I have to cover them. So I'm going to make out of them and, you know, but this is like, yeah, this does work. So like that. But I'm not there making uh, uh, tags, you, you all know, you know, you can put in a journaling tag, a uh, journaling card or tag. But I'm thinking, maybe. Maybe, maybe we need something on the front. And I was thinking about She's fine too. Sample design. I think you all already know. <laughs> because I have been using her little uh, bear, teddy bear image on my journals. Which actually is available to order if you are interested. It's on my Etsy. Uh, it's a blank journal. With a teddy and it is on, on elastics so i have youtube video as well what's in there so if you're in just you know if it's just like you know just in a case you are interested so anyway let's just put them in i love that image but oh can we do a little bit of this under of that embossed of that embossed rose And I want to staple it down. I will, I will kind of. Mm -hmm. 
glue it down. It's not stapling uh, strong, but strong enough. Sometimes. This is kind of fine. Oh, I do love this. something small <laughs> take my bag there is a lot of things in there and I love this white leaves as well but that would be like um, for um, what is name wedding <laughs> it would be too crazy but I had oh pink pink rose Oh, this would be as well very romantic. Shall we put them down? I really, really like lately, as you have seen, grunge with some romantic like bits. It is so cute. Oh, I have something like that as well. I don't really want to put white because it's not, I'm not like about, this is more very romantic, this is like really romantic, what is this, what is this, not sure i can think like that you know for a long time i'm not i'm not doing that to you guys aha i found it i had oh this now this is a big one i had small one somewhere maybe in this book i'm not sure guys um Or just maybe this. No, this is too white. No, no, no. Let's put that pink and we are done. Other one. Where I did it? Where, where is it? <laughs> Seriously? Ah, here, here, here. Okay. So let's close this down. And I'm stronger. If I can <laughs> open it, right? So, my lovelies, thank you so much. <laughs> I haven't finished yet, but anyway, thank you so much for subscribing and commenting and purchasing and joining me on a patron so and a lot more is coming i'm quite excited myself but you know anyway There is 
know like need for really like huge embellishing and if you really like it you can do little tie up you know or uh, yeah i don't have it like with lace or um, like twine come on move to it i think This is really nice. I'm not going, you know, you can make pockets even here as well. Doesn't matter. Is pocket here, you can do small uh, pocket there to put like little, uh, let's say, some embellishment, small ones, or little, a uh, term, not tags, tickets. Oh, this is really cool. Right, okay, let's move this down. Right, this is too long. And where is flowers? So that is, I don't think they need a lot of embellishment on this because it's a small one and it's like a little booklet. But we need a little bit of something, right? Proper, nice little booklet. I'm not doing any stamping, anything else. This is very cool. So, my lovelies, this is what we are making today. I'm quite happy. Yeah, so thank you for idea. I loved it. <laughs> and I do hope, guys, that you like it too. Right. Right, my lovelies. Thank you so, so much. And uh, see you very soon.